According to NBC News, President Biden's family is discussing his possible exit from the 2024 race. This is happening as a growing number of Democrats in the House and Senate say Biden should withdraw. At least 27 Democrats do not want to see him run in November. Peter Ducey has more. Critical days ahead. President Biden facing the stark reality that many Democrats at the highest levels want him to withdraw from the 2024 election. He doesn't look like a winner to right. people who have the juice in the party. And that's the bottom line. Joe Biden, for lack of a better word, is not competent to be the president of the United States. Isolated at his beach house in Delaware as he battles COVID, the president has time to reflect. People very close to the president, uh, both congressional leaders, personal friends, they believe he is going to get there, as they put it, over the weekend. The decision set against the backdrop of an enthusiastic Republican National Convention in Milwaukee. Trump hardly even mentioning Biden by name. Only going to use the term once. Biden, I'm not going to use the name anymore, just one time. The Biden for President campaign calling an all-staff meeting Friday. The DNC's rulemaking arm also expects to meet Friday. The series of leaks that we saw this week, that was the signal to him that not only do you not have the support you need on the Hill, you're not going to have the money that you need. And in a race against time, Democrats are considering the extraordinary possibility of a new presidential nominee. It's certainly not a process that we've taken before, but I love the belief that it's not a difficult process for the party. If President Biden decides to drop out, he will become the first incumbent president in more than 50 years not to run for re-election. In Rehoboth Beach, Delaware, Peter Ducey, Fox 32 Chicago.